Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel, Jacob's Family Reviews, where I give an honest, unbiased review on many different products from outdoors, electronics, household, lawn and garden, you name it. If I've got it, I'll review it. And then you decide if it's right for you. Like and subscribe. Thanks. Now, if any time during or after this video you wish to learn more about a product or want to purchase it, simply click on the link in the description below this video. When you click on that link, you'll be taken to my Amazon storefront video page like this. But don't worry about the video. You don't have to watch it again unless you want to. But you could click right here on the product link and that'll take you to that product. But before you do, if you could give me a thumbs up right here, I greatly appreciate it. Okay, on to the product. You click here and it'll take you to this page right here. Here's your Amazon page. Reviews, details, well, the whole works. It's Amazon, you know. Okay, without further ado, on to the product review. Thank you. Hey everybody, Jacob's Review is here. Today's review is going to be on the Samsung Harman Kardon, the 5.1.2 Q80R soundbar with the wireless subwoofer. Now this thing is, uh, it's incredible. I've, I've had it for about three years now. Uh, it has all the bells and whistles, of course. Alexa compatible, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, you could use it with the um, uh, SmartThings app, meaning you could control the subwoofer, all the controls like you can here with this remote, the settings, the sound mode, uh, if you want like game, movie, mode, theater, auditorium. He here's your input selection, uh, control the volume and, and the subwoofer. The app will let you control all those functions the same way you can here with this remote. Now, big question is, how does it sound? Well, let me tell you, it's an incredible sound, uh, sound bar. With that, with the subwoofer, it's pretty incredible. I'll show you here. Now, it's got two speakers on top. It's got one here and one here. And if you look, you could see that these speakers here, yeah, are angled like this. They're shooting out at an angle and the reason why it does that is because it shoots up and it banks off the ceiling and it goes back down to where you are sitting and it really creates an incredible sound effect so you got speakers there on top and you got one on each uh, side here you got one there and one right there and you've got several on the front here uh, you got, I think the ones in the center are pointed forward. The ones over here on the sides are more at a slight angle. So with speakers like that, the way it's set up, and the subwoofer, I think that's a, I think that's a 12, 12 inch subwoofer. Can't remember, 12 or 14, but that thing is heavy. I mean, it's solid. It is a solid, heavy subwoofer. It makes incredible sound. So. When we're watching a movie, action movie, uh, with sound like Star Wars or Days of Thunder or something, it is just incredible because it really sounds, I mean, you can hear the bass on this. I mean, that subwoofer is powerful. You can hear the bass throughout the whole room. And sometimes, I'm not kidding, when we're watching TV, we will hear sounds that is literally sounding like it's coming from way over there on that side, not so much on the right because the window's right here, but over there, it, 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 I, I don't know how, but there's no rear speakers. It's just that sound bar and then the subwoofer, but it really sounds like sound is coming from the far left. It's, it's just incredible. Um, and it's a solid uh, sound bar. It's got some weight to it, so it's crafted beautifully. I mean, it's just incredible. So, uh, yeah, and the way I recommend if you're going to hook this up is I have two inputs. Uh, one for the DirecTV, one for my Blu-ray. So I use the uh, two inputs here, and then the one output goes to the TV. So it's very simple. The HDMI 1 here, HDMI 2 here, and then an output, which goes to the back of the TV. And I suggest that. Overall, I highly recommend it. If you could afford this speaker setup, I would buy it. It's, uh, it's incredible. Thanks, I hope this review was helpful.